Hello everybody and welcome back to Gran Turismo 7, the real driving simulator with me, Dark Mazda for Dark Mazda Series Gaming. The last episode we were completing our uh, national, was it international? No, it was national air license and we were having a little bit of trouble with stick drift with our pad and the car kept nudging to the left um, since then I have got the pad exchanged at the shop which I got it from uh, very friendly stuff uh, they tested my pad found exactly the same fault and switched out my pad so um, big thumbs up to those guys um, it's just awful when you spend a lot of money on something and then it doesn't work and then there's like the possibility that they might not exchange it but um, obviously they have because they know that I take care of my stuff and um, yeah, here we are, we're back and we with some action. First time with the Neopad, so let's go to the world map and continue with our, um, well, with our career. So we didn't actually get gold um, trophies on absolutely everything on the um, National Air License, but um, we're gonna go back to it at some point because there is a trophy that requires us to do so. Um, but at the moment, we have to do the Championship Trial Mountain Cup, um, which is at the World Circuit here. And it's at the bottom right-hand corner. And we needed the air license to be able to do this. So we need to change the car because we need a car from the United States. So let's have a look. Um, we did upgrade this one here. At least I think it was. Um... Let's have a look. This one looks pretty sweet as well, mine. 620. Let's give this one a go anyway, because, um, you know, it's new. We haven't had a go of it yet, and we can't just drive the same cars all the time, right? So, yeah, let's, uh, let's do this. So, here we are, guys. Once we get past all these cars, it'll be easier to navigate the course. Oh, didn't half mess that one up there. Whoa. Oh man, stop banging into us. Oh, did you have to slow down so fast? I'm going into the back of yours. Right. Get out of my way. Let me through. Thank you. I guess I've got a lot of weight to go to catch up to the others now. I only get two laps. Right. Get him on the second lap, I think. At least I hope so, anyway. There we go, I can see them all anyway. I'm coming up to the second lap now, so we should be able to make some good ground on them now.
Yep. See a lot of other cars had went off at that point as well. Still got half the track to go, we should be okay with this guy. I think we're gaining on him anyway. Well, messed up that last corner. But we still managed to finish first. Yes, here we go. Need to get past all of these guys again. As long as we keep out of our way, we can actually get past them. And so there's the same course, but in reverse, right? taking the inside just to get past these guys and then we've got clear road so that we can maneuver properly nice long straight piece of road here man
That was a good little take over there. Nice long straight piece of road now. There we go, first place, lovely jubilee. And we got 30,000 credits for doing that one. Must be wanting us to buy some uh, decent cars at some point now. You were number one overall, we'll get another 40,000. Lovely. And we get to choose a car. Uh, we'll just go for the first one this time. Nissan 180SX Type X. So we're going back to the cafe again. I'm going to go and see um, Luca. Is it Luca? And he's going to give us another menu book to complete. Well done for winning the Trial Mountain Cup. That's an excellent result. I actually received a message from an American who watched the race. He wants you to pay a visit to his new shop. It's called Legend Cars, and I hear he's keeping it open for you. Why don't you head on over there once you've picked up your reward? Sarah should be able to give you more details. Lovely. More circuits have opened up, and Legend Cars has opened up as well. Collection Nissan Sports Cars. So we're going to have a look at that. Lovely. So we need to collect a Sylvia Specar Aero. Um, uh, R32 GTR Fee, Fair Lady Z version S. Okay. This time I'd like you to collect sports cars produced by the Japanese manufacturer Nissan. Nissan's GTR Z, Z and Sylvia sports cars are popular and much loved all over the world. Collect all three and bring them back here. I'll be waiting. So, yeah, we're going to do that. That's going to be our next mission. I wonder how many mission books there are. There must be quite a lot. So I'm going to have a look over there then. Welcome to Legend Cars. This is a special dealership known only to a handful of collectors. Legend Cars offers a living num number of highly sought after collectible cars from the 20th century. Along with a few iconic cars that have made their name on racetracks around the world. Can't wait to see what they have to offer us today. Alright. McNeil. Hello, welcome to the Haggerty Collection. I'm McNeil Haggerty and I'll be your advisor and guide to the collection. Here's the lineup of the cars currently available. Go ahead, wander around and kick the tyres, then it'll be your turn to take the wheel. Wow, look at how much these cars are. Mercedes-Benz S Barker Tourer 29, 13 million. 
McLaren F1 GTR BMW 95, that's 10.5 million. Jaguar D-Type, 6 million. Audi Sport Quattro, 2 million. Um, Dodge Challenger RT70, don't know what the arrow is there though, it means it's going up I guess. Porsche 962C. We've got oh, Lamborghini Countach. They are absolutely amazing cars. I love them. I played that on um, Need for Speed Heat. And that was just the car that I used all the way through the game just about. Oh wow. What Wicked stuff. Well, we've had a look. And we're going to do the collection book now. And collect, collect some Nissan sports cars. I'm guessing there's going to be races for them. So we're going to go over and do some of these races. The icons flashing here anyway. Asia Oceana. Alright, well this one here is open. So, uh, Clubman Cup 550. PP no limit, 3 laps. We've got to get 3rd place or higher. And we need a Japanese car. Um, suggested PP is 550. I think we need to up one of our cars. Um, you knows Roadster. We'll just purchase some parts and see what happens. Right, we've got it up to 566. Let's see if that um, makes any difference then. We just bought a load of parts. We don't know why we're buying them. We just hope that they improve the performance. So let's go for this then the Japanese Clubman Cup. And here we go.
what happens when they get in the way, they knock you off. Another two laps. I'm saying we can beat two minutes and nine. I'm sure we'll be able to. Oh, there's a slower lap. We're on our final lap now, though. Let's see if we can make it better.
And there we go, first position. And there's some of that money back. We were on 900,000. We're going to make that back up in these next three races. Wait, the next two. Following two coming up. This is one of our collection cars. Lovely. We'll go for this one, the Fuji International Speedway. And we're going to do the same. We're going to use the same car. He's the other guy you get. He's a little bit ahead of us. But I should be able to make some time upon him. I'm making a little bit of time on him.
be able to get him on the corners. Four star roulette ticket. Oh, lovely. And we picked up the Nissan R32 GTR 5. Driving gear, Alpine Star suit number one. Next up, we're going to the Tokyo Expressway. We need to get third place or higher. Three laps on this one. It's that one with the thin road, isn't it? I like this course. I'm not sure I like this skiddy car though. <laughs> part of the course it must be uh, another extended version of it it's hard to get past cars when they're on these thin roads you end up taking your turns wide and then bumping into the walls.
come on. Thin roads, let us pass. If you're not fast enough, you should let people pass you. Is that just one one lap there? Wow. in here, thank you. The one way I almost went the wrong way last time. Yeah, very tight corner. We got it though. Not perfect, but we got it. Last lap.
There we go. First place finish. That earns us 20,000 credits. There we go, we've acquired the last car in the collection book. We will go and see Luca and see what he's got installed for us now. Nissan Sports Cars completed. Congratulations, you've got all three cars. This completes your Nissan Sports Cars collection. Once you've collected your rewards, I've got some stories to tell you about these cars. The Nissan Z and the GTR. You might have heard of these cars before. These are legendary models loved by car fans all over the world. This Z33 is the 5th generation Nissan Z and it's great in both styling and performance. This R32 Skyline GTR is one of the great Japanese cars from the 1990s. It's truly a legend having been unbeatable in top Japanese domestic touring car races. The Sylvia is also a model that has been loved by countless fans over the years. Combining a powerful turbocharged engine with rear wheel drive, it's also a popular choice for drifting. It's easy to see why Nissan sports cars have always been a mainstay of Japanese car culture. Japanese rally base cars. Oh, so we're going to acquire a Subaru, a Mitsubishi, and a Toyota Yaris. Oh, lovely. Now, I'd like you to collect some Japanese rally base cars. Rallies are races in which cars built upon production models compete against each other. As the races don't take place on circuits, drivers tackle dirt roads, snow, and other challenging surfaces. As you can imagine, the base cars for rallying need to be pretty powerful and you're going to collect three of them. They're all four wheel drive, so all four wheels are driven. This is also known as AWD or all wheel drive. We are talking about some really nice motors here and I can't wait for you to bring them back to show me. We're going to quickly pop back to the garage now. I'm going to pick up that four star ticket that we got. We'll probably get the worst reward, but it's worth it just to see what we get. It's something for nothing. Go on, give us a nice loads of pile of bars of gold. Ah, uh, see, so give us the smallest one again. But it's about 10k. Yeah, wonder what the big one was. Oh well, we knew we were going to get the smallest reward. So guys, thank you very much for joining me on this episode of Gran Turismo 7, the Real Driving Simulator. I've been your host today, Dark Master, for Dark Master Series Gaming. And if you have liked the content and the racing, the uh, journey, so to speak, then give me a like and a sub, and next time we will continue um, collecting the Japanese rally base cars and f do a few more races, I presume, in order to get them. So until then, guys, that's goodbye from me, and I will see you guys on the flip side.